um, so good morning and welcome to the week 10 uh, challenge introduction. Okay, I think we can start. Can you see my screen? Okay, thank you. Okay, so uh, so this week uh, we are going to be using AI to plan a wedding. So it's going to be uh, another interesting challenge. So uh, in this uh, one week, we're gonna be uh, working as uh, a wedding planner or at an event, uh, like at a company called Oasis Events. So uh, it's a popular event planning company and your responsibility is going to be uh, to manage and ensure events are completed on time and uh, delivered, uh, the deliverables are on track. So uh, you just got a new client. Um, so they are famous clients. Uh, their name is uh, Kenya and uh, Kim. So they're getting remarried. Actually, they were remarried at first and they got divorced and they are getting uh, remarried again. So you're going to be hosting um, their uh, like planning and like uh, just uh, following and tracking their uh, wedding events. So uh, it's going to be uh, the best, like it's going to be a big, uh, maybe even the biggest uh, wedding of the century. So you are going to be doing these things. So you're going to be uh, creating the invites with image, uh, the schedule, the speech, uh, and PM the events and photos and uh, videos. So the expected outcomes are to improve the, your project uh, management efficiency, event planning and organizing, and um, efficiency improvement. Yeah, okay. So uh, the dates are, uh, what about, uh, so on Monday, today, we are ha having the change introduction, and on Wednesday, we're going to have uh we're gonna have uh the interim submission on uh, 8 p.m utc and the final on saturday so it's as you usual okay so uh who's interested like i think it's going to be an amazing uh project so yeah if you know is interested okay i'm sure everyone is <laughs> okay so uh, let's jump back to the developments and the tasks that's going to be uh, you are going to do, uh, to be doing in the time frame of one, one week. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna do is uh, you're gonna be designing an invitation card using uh, Canva. Uh, so you're gonna be creating the invitation card by using uh, Canva. So uh, you can create uh, the invitation by using the templates and generate a personalized various design with names, dates, and team using AI. So uh, AI is already integrated into Canva, so you can use that AI in order to um, just create uh, a personalized and like uh, cards, like invitation cards that you can choose from. Okay, so the second thing that you are going to be doing is uh, creating the schedule of the wedding. Uh, when we say this, uh, this is going to be uh, at the date of the wedding. So from the start, what are they going to do after the end? So this is going to be the event for the wedding, not uh, like the like the uh, decorations, the food preparations, like the guest listing and so on. That's prior to the wedding, right? So this is going to be uh, your schedule of the wedding. So the first thing you're gonna do is, uh, so it's just to develop a detailed wedding day schedule by using, you, you, you can use AI tools for uh, time management and uh, even sequencing. So what comes first, what comes second, even though you, you don't have any idea of how uh, wedding, uh, like these tips or 
the schedules or the sequence of events uh, that are going to be taking place uh, when we think, uh, talk about weddings, you can use AI for this uh, just to find out. So after you just name or list the significant events, uh, <coughs> sorry, of the wedding dates, um, so you're going to be creating a schedule. Uh, so you, you, uh, by using Trello, so you're, you're going to be inputting these uh, schedules or events into Trello. And uh, by using AI, you're going to be trying to optimize the time in the sequence just to ensure a smooth transition and adequate time usage for the entire event. So your output is going to, uh, you are going to share uh, your output or your final schedule uh, with relevant parties, in this case, with us. So, uh, okay. Is that clear, guys, so far? So good, can I see some reactions? Okay. Okay. Seems to be good so far. Okay. So the next, the task three is going to be uh, preparing speech. So um, especially in the Western world, um, so there is uh, like uh, like some of like uh, the closest friends, the parents, uh, parents and uh, like brothers and sisters give speech. Uh, at the wedding, right? So you're gonna be preparing this speech uh, for them. So you're gonna be uh, uh, like uh, preparing speech for the best man, the maid of honor, for the parents of both parties, and you can use some hu humor because they are getting uh, remarried. So like by having, uh, by knowing what you know, we're gonna be using AI like um, ChatGPT and other tools in order to just generate their speech for them. And uh, like, you're gonna be using, okay, without a question? <laughs> okay, uh, maybe not the ex-girlfriend, but maybe uh, just the parents, so it's good. We don't want to have a war at the wedding. Okay, so uh, you're gonna be inputting some basic information about the speaker and the couple. And uh, like, as I've said, like the information could be that uh, they're getting remarried. you can use humor and so on. For the best money, you can choose uh, one of uh, uh, Kanye's uh, closest friends and the Kim's closest friends and all the three their sisters and uh, just prepare the speech for them. So since they are fam famous people, I don't think, uh, it's going to be a dark heart. So, so after uh, the AI generates uh, the speech for you, just uh, uh, just add some personal touches and stylish adjustments, and just finalize your speech and submit them. Okay. So for events coordination and. Uh, management, which is going to be the last task, you're going to be using uh, the, this project management tool, specifically Asana for this uh, for this project, to just oversee and manage the entire uh, wedding planning process. So uh, you're going to be set, setting up uh, Asana, like just creating a project to over all the wedding planning uh like and then uh, just design and assign the tasks so you can use the uh, tutors uh, for this one so just list the planning activities so this is going to be prior or during the wedding but it's not part of the wedding like i've said earlier so uh, during the wedding there there, there there could be time for dances um like a uh, cake or like dinner time and so on. But these things are like, uh, just like the vendor management, uh, uh, guest list tracking, the corset up, uh, just ordering the food or, or so on. So these are like more of on the background of the wedding. So this is going to be set up by, uh, for the team. So during the wedding, uh, 
it it is set up for the groom and the bride and uh, like the close friends, right? So, uh, especially like le let's say during uh, let's say the dance time, like I, I don't know what they call it, but uh, it's going to be for the groom and the bride, right? So it's not your task. But here, like the decor, setting up the decor is the task for the team. So you, you're going to be using Asana for this. So you're going to assign uh, these tasks to the team me members and assign the deadlines, uh, track task co completion, and uh, overall project pro uh, progress using uh, Asana's platform. The platform is a dashboard, and you can automate uh, Asana. Uh, just to give you reminders, no, notification, like based on the deadlines. So, like, uh, like you can set up like before thirty minutes or an hour before the deadline, just to uh, give you a notification or a, a reminder and so on. So uh, that's going to be it uh, for the tasks for this week. So, any questions, guys? So far. Oh. Okay, Gitarri seems to understand what about the rest. Okay. Okay, that's good. Okay. Okay, so for the due dates for the uh, interim some submission that it's going to be submitted on Wednesday, you're going to be submitting um, your uh, invitation card in a PDF form that you have created by you using uh, Anva and your link to your Trello. So uh, after you have li listed your um, task or uh, like schedule, you're gonna be uh, like putting them in Trello, so you're gonna be sharing us that uh, card, that link. Okay, for the final submission, that's going to be on uh, Saturday. You're gonna be submitting uh, invitation link to your Asana and a PDF uh, for for a PDF. So. Uh, so your report is going to have uh, the following components. So a report on uh, Asana and how it's important for event planning. You generated a report from Asana. So you're gonna be generating uh, reports uh, of the completion, right? Like by tracking, by using the dashboard. So you're, you're gonna be submitting that one too. You, we are going to be show, showing you how to do that. And uh, the speech that you have generated for the group, like the best man, the bridesmaid, um, and the parents, uh, for both parents, and you can add uh, the siblings. So yeah, that's going to be what you are going to be submitting. And so for the schedules, so we, we just had the introduction to the challenge. Um, so in the afternoon, uh, you're gonna be having introduction to Canva, using uh, for creating invitation cards just yeah okay and tomorrow on tuesday you're going to be having a session on using asana for uh, project management and on wednesday you're going to be having a session on using ai to generate speech uh, by yeah yeah and on friday we, we're going to have uh, a Q and A session, and yeah, so that's it for now. Uh, so the floor is yours. If I have any questions, okay. Um, let me check if there were any questions on job uh, box. <laughs> Okay, like the message, like the messages are wild. Like, 
what kind of questions are these? Um, are there any questions uh, like related to like, just for it to me or? Okay. If there are no questions, can I see um, some reactions and we can end the session? But um, like, uh, like who understands well? Like, um, who can like repeat it to me? Because I want to see your understanding of the project. I don't want to just like uh, take it for granted. So like, who can explain the project back to me? Like, just one student, if you don't mind. Or shall I just call out names? Okay, Gitari. Thank you. And yeah. Yeah. Okay. So uh, this is a, a wedding event. Hello. Um, uh, hello. Hello. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I think your voice is a bit far. Can you hear me now? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, so this is a wedding event, and uh, we are trying to prepare this wedding between Kani and Kim. So we will start uh, by designing an invitation card for those people who are supposed to attend the wedding and we'll be using Canva tool to do that and AI. Uh, then we go to uh, our task two, uh, which will be about uh, creating a schedule for that very day, the very day for the wedding. We create how events will occur during the wedding day. Then you go to... Uh, for task three, we will be using AI to create speeches uh, for people who will speak during the wedding. And uh, task four, we are going to uh, to prepare how the events that will occur before the wedding occurs. And this event should lead, should lead to the wedding success. Yeah, that's all. OK. Um... Thank you for the explanation. So, anyone else who want to add? Uh, wants to add? Kinjala, uh, yeah. Uh, so it's interesting one. Um, so we will see how it goes. Yes, I think the the Rafael, you opened your mic. Okay, uh, so anyone else? Maybe, maybe just one more question, like. <laughs> um, okay, uh, so anyone else? Uh, so then maybe, uh, okay. Yeah, 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 okay, okay. Maybe share in the chat box if you can. Okay, maybe from sir. Okay. Hello. Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Good morning. Uh, this week's challenge is is an amazing one. Uh, the task is uh, going to have uh, uh, the way how we are going to create an invitation card by using Canva, uh, preparing the schedule of the events by using Trello. And again, we are going to prepare uh, the speech by using AI. And finally, we are going to coordinate the events. Uh, generally, the challenge is all about this one. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Thank you, Promsa, for sharing. Um, just um, just to add uh, a couple of things. That, like uh, there are a lot of uh, a lot of templates that you can find on Canva, but like try to make it uh, just try to personalize it. Like uh, I believe um, 
I believe that um, they're well known and uh, you can, like, I think they already have a child. So uh, just try to use these informations when creating a, a Canva, like in the invitation card, just to make, just try to be innovative with it. Because um, like anyone can make um, like, like, like any card, but just try, just adding that, even AI can create the invitation card, but adding that personalized uh, touch uh, that makes it special for the uh, groom and the bride is going to add a lot of uh, value to the card. So that's just uh, an additional, like uh, additional uh, uh, tip for, from me. But yeah, if everyone, uh, if okay, uh, let's just hear from the file and we can end the session if uh, there are no uh, more questions. So. They're fair, open your mic and you can speak. Okay, thank you. Uh, as general, the, uh, as my understanding, we are on this week uh, challenge. We are stepping the wedding plan. Uh, events, tasks with organizing the hype, by building for Kenny and the uh, Kim. There are objectives and the outcomes. The objectives is manage and ensure wedding events and the expected comes are improved efficiency and progress management. Uh, there are four tasks. Uh, the first task is design an invitation card using Canva, creating the, it may be creating visual appealing, the create meeting schedule using Trello, the create speech using AI, and the event coordination management using Asana. This is I'm understanding from the project. Thank you. Okay. Uh, thank you, uh, Rafael, for your uh, insights. So, yeah, uh, that's it from me. Uh, if there are any questions, the floor is yours. If not, um, um, just show me some thumbs up and kind of the session. Okay, uh, that's good. Let me just stop the recording.